and welcome to today's video. So I'm here with a home bargains haul and yes, my change of hair is because millennials have got to me. <laughs> um, I feel old with a side parting so I'm trying out a middle parting at the minute. It's taken a few days, <laughs> let's be honest. It's not looking great but it's working. So everything I've got here is from like two shopping trips to home bargains. So they are two different shops because some of them had some stuff in, some didn't have other stuff. And I actually went with a list. I watch all the home bargains hauls and that before I go. So I screenshot things so I know what I'm looking out for. Um, otherwise you can easily miss stuff I think. So that is what I did and there were still a few things I didn't find that I really wanted to. So there might be another haul in a few weeks time next time I go. Um, depending on if I see the things that I've missed. I'm going to start, so yes, I have left like all the fun things um, to go through so it's not so boring. I'm so excited for everything here. So like I said, we are moving house. We are moving house. I've been saying this for about a year now. I thought I would start buying things like I have been for about a year now just to get us started. So Homebaggers have just released this new range of bamboo things including these uh, glass jars with bamboo lids so these are obviously so ikea and yeah, a fraction of the price well actually to be honest i think they're about the same price these were 2.49 for the each um and these are the medium sizes so you get smaller one and then you get a much taller one and obviously these are for food storages so in the new house we have got a pantry um, so I will be displaying things oh so nicely in jars like this. So I, I love this bamboo range they have in and I've got a few things to show you actually from this range. It's very Ikea I think, a lot of it is very Ikea. And what I mean when I say just like Ikea, there is also this big massive thing. This is even the biggest one, I think this is the smallest size one they did. So this one is actually 2 .99. I think the bigger one was $3.99, um, maybe $4.99, I can't actually remember. But yes, I loved this. I was going to know about this at the stand for a while, just mainly because I didn't know which size to go for. It was in the first time I went to the another shop, and then when I went to my more local one, it actually wasn't in there, so I am glad I bought this, because I would have walked away thinking that I needed it. Um, again, I don't know what's going in it, it's just going to be in my pantry, it's going to be one of the last minute things where I'm like, oh, I could stick... So and so with it. I did originally think biscuits. Um, you know, like the whole Chloe Kardashian, how she stacks it around. I did try it and it does look good. Um, I should have gone for the bigger one if I was going to do that. But I was thinking smaller one means I only need maybe two packets instead of like four packets to fit it. Um, maybe a sweetie jar. I think pick and mix sweets will look quite good in here. Although I think it may be a bit too big. I would literally need like two of the big sizes of the pick mix But that's an idea. It's an idea, it means I will always have pick mix in the house. So yes, like I said, this, oh my God, I love it. Also for the kitchen, I was loving this. This is just a long chopping board, or what they actually said is a serving board. I was more thinking this will look really good with um, another chopping board behind it or something. It could go, I would use it as a serving board. If you've seen my Instagram, you'll know I have loved doing the sweetie kind of boards, food boards. So yes, that is what I was thinking. This was like 2 49 I think, maybe cheaper. one ninety nine. this serving board, that's why I got it. But I also thought on open shelving, I think it looked really good as well for just a display kind of thing, or for layering, um, yes. I love this. Like I said, for $1.99, that is why I bought it. So, another bamboo thing from their range. I think this is from the bamboo range. I'm not even sure. Something else that I went in for looking for, I am so happy I found it in the second store I went in. And it is this wicker tray. So, this is... This was only $4.99 and it is rather big. Um, I love it. I don't actually know what I'm going to use it for. I think it would go really nicely on a coffee table with an array of vases and candles in it. I think it'll look great. It'll look great in a kitchen with cooking books in it or utensils, 
uh, part with utensils in it. Honestly, I don't know. It could go in the dining table with candlesticks on it. I honestly don't know. But like I said, I saw this and loved it. If you was ordering this offline on Etsy or something like that, you'd be paying the price for it. It would be at least £15. So, this £4.99, I love it. It is so well made as well. It feels very sturdy. I hope they're keeping this out because it was in the Mother's Day range and I really like it. It is this gold mirror tray. They should bring this out anyway, not just with the Mother's Day stuff because it is so nice. It is the perfect size. I've been looking for a gold tray that isn't really big or isn't really small. Um, so this was like the perfect size one. Like I said, it was in the Mother's Day section and I just I really like it. Um, this one I think is probably going to be more for my dressing room. Um, I think it'll, the style will fit a lot better in there. But again, you could literally put this anywhere. Again, a coffee table, a dining table, a shelving. It looks quite nice on shelving just like that, even if you can't see the mirrored bit. This mirror tray was actually only 4 99 which is a bit weird that it's priced the same as that wicker one, I think. But... You know, I like it. I think it looks great. So I ummed and about this next thing. Um, purely because I thought, again, if I see it there, I'm not going to see it the next time. And that is exactly what happened. So I'm glad I did buy it. But again, I'm not sure where it's going to go. Because it's not quite the colour that I wanted. I mean, it could be painted. Anyway, I will show you it. So it is this vase. It has got this gorgeous detail in the middle. It does, like, stick out. But the colours I loved, there was only this or a pink one. It's a bit annoying that they didn't have more of like a beigey cream one rather than it being grey. I mean, it could work. It is rather big. It was 5 99 this. And I am glad I bought it though. I mean, I will find somewhere for it. I think it'll be quite a good one actually with long stems of dried grass or puma or something in it. Um because it is quite big. Again, not sure where it's gonna go, but I am glad I bought this. Every time I go in Home Bargains, I cannot leave without my favorite face sheet mask. This is the Garnier one, and the lavender one is my favorite. It is so hydrating, and it's so good at reducing any spots. Um, I love it. Like I said, literally every time I go in, because they are cheaper than if you used to buy them in the supermarkets or in Boots unless they're on offer um but in home bargains they are always they're always 1.99 which i think it's like a pound cheaper than what they are everywhere else i'm sure it's like a pound cheaper um so yes i always buy them i bought a collection of things that some people might find boring but um as a homeowner i am in love with and that is the exotic bloom range from lenore and when I say the whole range, I also got the Febreze. <laughs> yes, I am cray cray. I love this scent. I'm going to stop hooking these now. This smells amazing. It's supposed to be like alien. Um, I don't think it smells like alien, but I do love the smell of it. It's one of those that if you use, I didn't get the pods. Only because I didn't need them for the price of like £3 or £4 or something. For the same ones as the um, cheap ones so i just buy the cheap ones but using these two together on your laundry honestly it makes my whole house smell like this um i wash my bedroom with it and it's still a few days later smells like this so it's really good and if you have this and then put the clothes on straight away honestly you don't have to wear perfume because this smells enough by itself if you have like the whole outfit with these the only thing I'm gutted about is the fact that they used to run out so quickly. You only get, I reckon, maybe about six uses out of them. Um, and that's if you sparingly. But I I do love these Unstoppables. I <sighs> Scent boosters is just something that you don't need. It's something I will buy only when I'm in home bargains or unless it's on offer in the supermarkets because they can be pricey. It could be like £5 for one of these. In home bargains... 2 .99 in home bargains so that is like probably the cheapest place you will find them um yes i just love having a whole collection of things that just look pretty together and like i said i have been putting off using the febreze as well 
Um, this is in the same scent. I went searching for this. My mum was helping me look for the exact scent I wanted in the first shop and it wasn't in there. It was in the second star though. Um, so yes, I am glad I got the whole collection because now my furniture, my sofas, the carpet, the curtains, everything will smell like this. And it's even a good way for refreshing in your clothes up. Um, after like one wear, if it's not like dirty and really stinky, then refresh it up and you can wear it again. And you can still smell the same. So I've seen these all over. I mean, you can order these from online. I will show you first. I keep doing that. I don't show you what I'm talking about. They are these labels for storage and organisation. So this one is a... Yes, I got the laundry one, which says tablets, powder and softener in silver. They do it in rose gold as well, which I personally don't like the rose gold. That depends whatever you're looking for. So I'm looking for loads of storage for my utility stuff as well, because I do have a utility laundry room in the new house um, that I'm very excited about. And I've been putting off using these already, because I have got the storage stuff already that I could use. And I've, like I said, I've just been putting off to film this video. So you can find these on Etsy and Instagram shops. A lot of Instagram shops are doing things like this now. And they can be pricey as well as like having a delivery because the delivery is like £3, maybe £4 from these places. And in-home bargains. So I actually can't find the receipt for the ones I bought these. But I only think there was like 79p. And they have loads of different um, sticker sheets. So that there's laundry, there is kitchen there's bathroom there is like cleaning ones i did have a look for some more and unfortunately my store when i went to have a look there was literally just these and uh the bathroom ones which i was actually looking for the cleaning ones but they didn't have them in the silver so it's one of the things you've got to really keep a look out for but like i said 79p if you was to buy this off of the Nexus store you would be looking at at least a fiver by the time you've got the delivery as well so yes I am really excited about that. So the next thing is really big actually because it is a pendant light. Oh my gosh, look at that. So they have loads of new lighting in home bangs at the minute. I've been looking for something so similar to this actually in the range. Um, this was 19 99 which is the same price in the range. Um, but I do think this is slightly maybe bigger so this is for our main bedroom in the new house which means i have officially finished buying all of our light fittings for the new house um so yes i'm very happy about that i believe that is like something ticked off ready i thought this is just gorgeous this is gonna go so nicely in a gray room even if we like change the colors up in a few years time um it'll still look really nice i think i think it's quite a classy kind of chandelier looking thing without it being in your face um, so yes, like I said, only 19.99, and I was so happy when I found this because I had screenshot this and put it on my list, and then I purposely went looking for this, and I'm just so happy that it was in my store because if it wasn't, I'd have been so upset about that. So yes, I got lots of fun things in this haul. That is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next week for a brand new one. Thanks for watching. Bye.